again welcome back to the channel <clears throat> on this video we're going to talk about a new fat tire e-bike that's out there now I'm not riding it I'm riding the Lyric Graffiti right now but I'm going to talk about a new bike fat tire 20 by 4 inch Kenda Crusade tires it's the EMX Extreme XT and it's by Fabulous E-Bikes and this one kind of catches my eye because it's got a couple of pretty cool features and I'm going to tell you some of those as we ride around here on the graffiti so first off it's a 60 volt so I'm starting to see more and more 60 volt bikes, which is pretty cool. Uh, it seems like we're getting a little bit away from some of the 48 volts and getting a lot more into 52 and 60 or even 72 volt. So a little more punch, which I think is a good thing. So this bike is a dual motor as well. So that's the other big feature dual motor and 60 volt now the motors are both 750 watt front and rear and they both feature 100 Newton meters of torque so you got a lot of torque there so I don't think hill climbing will be any issue now the battery on this bike is a 24 amp hour Samsung 60 volt battery so not bad not a bad size battery but it's not the greatest when you're using two motors it wouldn't take too long if you're using both motors a lot to uh, chew up that battery so you'd probably want more like minimum of 30 amp hour probably I don't know that 24 seems kind of low for dual motor to me but anyway that's what it has good morning it does also have hydraulic brakes it has hydraulic suspension and let's see what else does it have it has a color display i'm trying to remember here uh, it is torque sensor so for you out there looking for the torque sensor as opposed to cadence uh maybe this bike is for you it has cruise control i want to go to the street it has cruise control it does have front and rear fenders it comes in three colors black red or blue the bike weighs 80 pounds and has a weight capacity of 300 pounds now I couldn't find anything on speed top speed or uh, battery range uh, I could not find any but I will leave a link in the description if you want to go and check out the specs on the bike uh, maybe they're there and I just overlooked them but I tried to do some lookup, couldn't find it, so. So that's pretty much all. It does have cruise control. I don't know if I mentioned that, but it does have cruise control. It does have front 
like the headlight and the tail light and it does have a horn no turn signals that I saw although more and more bikes are getting turn signals on right now which is a good thing I think I mean you could put them on yourself but it's nice to just have them on the bike so the bike is ready to go when you buy it a uh, couple of other things I could not find shipping. I don't know if it's free shipping or not. I can't say either way. So you might want to look into that. And there's something else. Oh yeah, I was gonna mention also one more thing on the bike. It comes with a three amp charger. So it's going to take a little bit of time. I didn't see how long it takes to charge the battery, but I got to think with a three amp charger, it's going to take a little bit to charge that, being a 24 amp hour battery. The nice thing about the uh, Aerial Rider Grizzly version two is that it came with two chargers and they're both 5 amp. So that's really nice to be able to not only charge a little faster being a 5 amp charger, but having two of them. Now if you buy version 3, it only comes with one charger and that's unfortunate. I think, same with this bike here, it only has one charger. I think if they're going to give you dual batteries like as part of the bike if you buy the dual battery setup or if they come like the Grizzly come with uh, dual batteries you know uh, standard so you didn't get a choice of one battery or two but if it's going to come with two batteries I think they should give you two chargers that way you can charge both batteries up at the same time, especially on a bike like the Grizzly, that if you turn both batteries on, it's drawing from both batteries at the same time. And you can charge them up, you know, and then you're ready to go. But the one thing on the Grizzly that I don't like is the fact that the batteries are not the same size. And the chargers, at least on the version 2 that I have, each charger is for uh, one particular battery. So because of the uh, plug being different. And the thing too about that bike is that I don't like the fact that the batteries are two different sizes. I mean, just make them both the same. I, they should have probably, like one's 20 and one's 15 amp. I think they should have went with 220s, but of course I'm going to say that. I'm not going to say uh, it should go with 215s. The more uh, battery, the, the better, right? So. so anyway, I will leave a link in the description. If you want to check out the EMX Extreme XT by Fabulous E-Bikes, it's a dual motor, 60 volt, 24 amp hour battery. And like I say, I couldn't find anything on speed, range, or shipping. Three important things. But uh, you can either uh, check the website there, like the link that I give you, or you might have to, if, if, it, if you can't find it, you may have to email them and ask them uh, uh, what the, uh, those specifics are, because those are important. And One more thing I forgot to mention, of course, the price. It's a little bit on the pricey side, I think. It's uh, running at $28.99. That's the uh, price. So I would hope shipping is free, paying that much money, but I don't know. It might be for somebody out there, they might like this bike for that price. 
I think it's a little bit overpriced, but uh, because I think you can do better for less money. Let me know in the comments if you have any comment on the uh, video. And that's going to do it for another video here on the channel. If you like this video, hit that like button. If you'd like to subscribe to the channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And thank you very much for doing that. And if you want to be notified as to when the next video comes up on the channel, just hit that notification bell and you'll be notified. And if you want to leave a comment on this or any other video, go ahead and leave that in the comments below. Once again, thank you for joining me for this video. And until next time.